The Charity Walk for Peace is an annual flagship event hosted by Majlis Ansarullah UK. The event brings together members of Majlis Ansarullah to help raise funds for a wide range of UK-based charities, including the British Royal Legion, the British Heart Foundation, Macmillan Cancer Support, the Royal Air Force Association, Action for Children, and Humanity First to name a few. To date, the Charity Walk for Peace campaign has raised over £6.2 million for UK-based charities. After a two-year hiatus caused by the global coronavirus pandemic, the highly anticipated annual walk was hosted again around the town of Morden, home to the Battle of Thu Mosque. Before the walk began, a small reception ceremony was held within the mosque complex. This reception began with a recitation of the Holy Quran. وَمَا تَفْعَلُوا مِنْ خَيْرٍ فَإِنَّ اللَّهَ بِهِ عَلِيمٌ Chairman of the Charity Walk for Peace, Mr. Zahid Jatoy, welcomed the attendees. Our aim is to help relieve the sufferings of the poor and to promote peace, understanding and goodwill amongst people of all walks of life. to all our participants who have come and joined us because it is each one of you that gives us that special motivation to continue our work the event brought together various charity representatives councillors mayors as well as civil service and armed forces representatives all of which offered words of support for the community and the charitable efforts some guests included mrs lynn cooper the high sheriff of greater london money that has been raised over the years i think is truly phenomenal for all sorts of local charities but also national and international the work that this charity does and the work that the community does is completely terrific graham ferris from the royal british legion it is so wonderful to be back amongst you to be back amongst um, our friends at the mosque um, we have always been so welcome it is my honor and my privilege to be here today and I wish everyone taking part in the walk today a safe and enjoyable event Paul Scully MP Minister for London and Parliamentary Under Secretary of State Thank you to you for all the work that you've done for your community for the Ahmadiyya community but for the wider community as well reaching out and making sure that people are okay and supporting them through their hour and months of need Councillor Mark Allison leader of the Merton Council It means a great deal to me that you are all here today. It means a great deal to the people of Merton that you are all here today. And I'd like to thank you again for organizing this event and many others, including the Right Honorable Dominic Raab MP, the Deputy Prime Minister, Lord Chancellor, and Secretary of State for Justice. Particularly at this moment in in time for the country, to find you all coming together from such diverse backgrounds um is a an incredibly positive fantastic expression of a community coming together and our community is coming together and i think uh, could never be more important time for us to have that the ahmadiyya muslim community has a history of serving its communities and nation and this was compounded with the ceremonial signing of the armed forces covenant representing a promise of support to those who serve and have served their nation and organizations within it honorary captain of the royal navy durdana ansari obe and chairman of the charity walk for peace zahid jatoy signed the covenant to show the ahmadiyya muslim community uk's support to those who serve their country the chair of the event mr akram ahmadi naib ummi jamaat uk offered a few brief remarks before commencing the walk we don't only hold one center world, but we hold it around the country small ones regional ones so that the whole of not only our community but the communities that they live can participate in this work this is a very important and spiritual work for the ahmadiyya muslim association It gives us great pleasure this year to sign the covenant with the british legion that is very important to us for the work that they do over the 100 years that they have done that and may god continue to support them and we shall also support them in all the ways that we can the walk itself was hosted locally within the morden area and began with a military procession led by young pipers for more details on the charity walk and to find out how to get involved please visit charitywalkforpeace.org this report is brought to you from mt international uk studios
in London.